Thank you for watching, liking, commenting, sharing, and subscribing right now. You've probably hit the frustration of needing to find information about hardware or software, and of course then you reach for the manual, and you flip through it, and you say, I know it was in here somewhere, and you can't find it. I am so done with printed manuals. Not only are they a waste of paper, in my mind, uh, a waste of space, and inevitably they, they lead to nothing but frustration, because you can't find things easily. Now, take, in comparison, the PDF. You can do a quick search and find exactly what you're looking for. No muss, no fuss. Quick, easy, accessible. You could read it on an iPhone. You could read it on the desktop. Whatever. Electronic manuals are the way to go. Despite what my mom was saying to me the other night when I was trying to walk her through a problem that she was having. Why don't they make software manuals anymore? It's just so much easier. I try to use the online help, but it never works. Well, it's not the online help doesn't work. It's just you, I'm not trying to, you know, say my mom's crazy or anything, but you kind of got to know what you're looking for in order to be able to find it. I mean, it's not going to walk you through step by step. That's kind of what screencasts are for. And yes, maybe I should do more screencasts, but there's so many of them out there. I, I really don't know what I would screencast. For instance, I don't know why I would dare screencast this website because I'm just going to tell you about it. It's a place where you can find manuals. Not the printed kind, if you want to print them out, that's your prerogative. But I mean the electronic kind. OwnerIQ.net. Let me uh, zoom in here so you can see it. There's the logo. OwnerIQ, as in the owner, you own something. IQ is in intelligence quotient. That's, that's what IQ stands for, in case you didn't know. Uh, get the most out of the products you own. Locate hard to find user manuals. Discover new features. Realize the potential of products you own. Blah, 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 blah. And the list goes on and on. I mean, if you can name a product that has a manual, it may very well be listed on here. In fact, that's one of the first things that I do when I buy any kind of uh, digital camera uh, after selling my old one. I'll look for the electronic version of the manual because it's easier to find features that I need uh, by searching in line rather than thumbing through a manual that's written in potentially a couple languages that I don't speak. Uh, this way, it's clean, it's easy. If you do not know where to locate your manual, try owneriq.net. Uh, another place that has taken to indexing electronic manuals, Amazon. Um, you know, that's, uh, that's one of the things that I, I wish uh, they would uh, kind of provide with the Kindle. But then again, the Kindle isn't very powerful. Ooh, you know what? It would actually be a neat, uh, I'm looking around for my iPhone here. I know, oh, here it is. It's charging. I, I, I ran the battery down. It'd be neat to have like an application that if I like keyed in a UPC code or took a picture of a UPC code or a box or whatever, it would automatically find the manual and then index it uh, locally on the iPhone as well as made a copy on my desktop. Wouldn't that be kind of neat if I just keyed in a product and had it as I'm walking around? I'm like, what's the, you know, I need a manual for the speaker. Oh, I need a manual for the MacBook. And then have it automatically happen. Wouldn't that be, I just, that's just my idea. You know, I can't program anything, you know, to, to save my life. I just come up with neat ideas. That would be neat, though. I think it's neat. Even, even if you don't have an iPhone, though, still, owneriq.net. Download those manuals. You, you'll save yourself a lot of time and frustration, and you'll save a few trees. My email address is chris at perillo.com. If you know of any other consumer-friendly resources, please pass them along. Of course, you're also welcome to make those recommendations on geeks.perillo.com, and you can post your own screencast there as well. I mean, you can embed YouTube videos, upload videos, you know, post pictures, whatever. Uh, I mean, as long as the content is your own. Then, of course, you're also welcome to join us in the chat room, which is typically talking tech. Uh, we don't really talk about software manuals or hardware manuals, really, but, you know, now we may remember where you can go if you don't remember where we just told you to go to find manuals. We are talking about hardware and software and games and gadgets and gizmos and you name it. Uh, it's, trust me, someone's talking about it 24 hours a day, seven days a week in conjunction with this live video feed at live.perillo.com. We'll see you later.